the one CS forever CS rule only follows if the indication for the previous cesarean section was CPD or cephalopelvic disproportion or masikip ang sipit-sipitan. However, if the indication for the previous CS was because of malpresentation or placental problems or fetal distress, then pwede actually mag-try mag-VBAC. However, depende also yan pa rin sa assessment ng OB mo. Now, um, usually during pregnancy, if your previous CS, we actually um, request for ultrasound to monitor your uterine scar. Now, kung even if ang indication for cesarean mo previously was malpresentation, kung ang thickness ng cesarean scar mo is manipis, then definitely hindi ka namin papayagan mag-vaginal birth after delivery or VBAC. What you always need to remember is ang priority talaga namin is safety more than anything. Now, if trying VBAC will actually increase the risk of complications, then definitely no OB will allow you to go to undergo this procedure. Now, kung hindi naman na monitor ang uterine scar, but extra sensitive ang pregnancy, meaning on and off, on and off ang contractions, or on and off, on and off ang hypogastric pain and heaviness, then this is also a possible reason na hindi kaya allow ng OB mo to undergo VBAC.